This is the M4 weapon build that I've been using for the past few weeks. It may not have the best possible stats you could get for this platform, but at the very low price of 135,000 rubles, this gun is absolutely capable of killing any squad you may meet, and is perfectly balanced in terms of recoil, ergonomics and price, making it one of my favorite guns of all time. You will quickly notice there's a couple of differences between this gun build and the most expensive Metem Force that you see used by chats and streamers alike. First difference is the lack of a suppressor. Some of you may not agree with this, but personally I think that a suppressor is not really a necessity. Sure, it is nice to have, especially on larger maps to conceal your movement around the map, but overall I have not noticed any real differences in my raids when running the gun loud. Even though the whole map can hear me going wild, it doesn't seem that people care enough to come looking for me. And with the added benefits of much greater ergonomics and tons of money saved, loud is definitely the way to go if you want to be cost effective. The other main difference in my build is that I'm using 40 rounders instead of the more typically used 60 rounders. Why? The answer is the same, cost efficiency. When making this gun, I carefully thought about every single attachment I used, how much it costs and what value it adds. With the 60 round mags in a good day costing 50,000 and now with the high flea market prices even costing 100,000 rubles, the 40 rounders at just 7,000 are a no-brainer deal. They are still enough to spray down multiple targets with one mag and there are plenty of armor options that you can wear which allow the use of a 3 slot magazine. Add to the fact that, again, you get a lot more ergonomics, and there is no reason why you shouldn't use the 40 rounders, unless you are just packed with rubles. As for the sight, it's completely personal preference, but most of the time I'll be running an optic of some sort, my favorite being the TAC-30. The light weight of the AR-15 platform, combined with the high ergonomics, will allow you to stay scoped in for a long time, so if you can afford an optic, by all means, go for it. As for the overall stats, here's what the Loud M4 build gives you. Vertical recoil is at a reasonable 42 points, and ergonomics sits at a very high 65. If you're curious to see the full weapon build so that you can build it yourself, I've linked it down in the video description. But now it is time for my favorite part, the highlights. Come on, fellas, let's put some fucking lead in them! Hey, what did you say, motherfucker? Come on. What did you say?
Thank you guys for watching all the way to the end. If you enjoyed this, consider leaving a comment and subscribing for more. I'll see you in the next video.